Now we've got a call all the way from the United States now, Clinton. Low power Even selected. Lacey. Speech off. Hi. It's Hi. Good to see you again, Natalie. We spoke on Talking Balls. Sir, if you remember ah, that, we spoke amazing. on so, that. Talking Balls is a show I present on BBC Radio Manchester. Lacey, thank you so much for giving yeah. us a ring tonight. So have you been keeping an eye on, on, the, uh, on the Euro? Yeah, I mean, I, I watched England. I, I listened on Radio 5 Live, so... That's amazing. It we, was a we great game. That. So what are you, what, what's your kind of take on how England have been getting on for the last three games? I think they, I mean, I think they've been doing well. I mean, the game against Austria, it's like, okay, they scored one goal, you know, and I know fans were expecting more goals, but Serena Bigman did say, you know, no matter how many goals we score, we get three points. Mm. And she has a really good point there. And um, speaking of her, I, I do feel for her since she can't be here today. Um, you know, it, it's quite a disappointment for her as the coach to not be there supporting her team. And um, I feel for her. Thankfully, it didn't seem to affect them them too much. Mm. Um, how, yeah. how, how far do you think they're going to go, Lacey? I mean... I would like them to hopefully win it, but I really, I mean, if they're doing this well, they could. They, if they're doing this well every single game, it's like they, they could win it. Like, they could. Okay. Lacey, are you, are you just following Euro because you're a women's football fan or is there, have you got an English connection? I'm a, just a big fan of the women's game. I mean, the oh, first time I really nice. found out about it was from the United States women's team and you know, um, I started watching England, and you know, I just knew how just knew how amazing they were as a squad, and it's powerful, really, to see you know women on the field and in a sport that was male dominated a lot, and um, you know, like what the United States is doing is fighting for equal pay and mm. fighting for equal rights and treatment, and um, you know, they're amazing for doing that. But it was a great win for England, five to nothing. Lacey, I was like, wow. You I know, want, it's I, like, wow. Lacey, I want to ask you a question. Who's your favourite England player and how far do you think England can get? So I asked you two questions there, really. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, my favourite player? I mean, that's difficult. <laughs> that's so hard. I mean, that's super difficult. I mean... All right, Alexa give me a Russo's few. Amazing. Give me, yeah. <laughs> I, I'd agree with you, Russo. Yeah, Russo's very good. She, she's been good. You can give me a few. I don't want you to pick one. Just just say who do you think, who's been the best um, best player so far for England? Well, I left here, Russo, as I said. Yes. Beth Mead. Yes. Um, I think those two have been the best. And then Georgia Stanway, she scored the penalty in the, not, the, not this one, but the last game. Lacey, I feel like I you believe. can... Um, you, you're a good person to ask because obviously you, 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 um, you're in America. American women's football is pretty much the pinnacle. Obviously, you guys are our World Cup champions as it stands. With the next World yeah, Cup around the corner, right. are you are you worrying about England? Are you going are you going to start keeping an eye? Do you think they do you think they might rival America? They probably will. They're both. They're two really good teams. And yeah, I think there's there's going to be a big rival, rivalry going on, huge rivalry between the two. And they played each other in 2019, um, and in the semifinal in the U.S. won, and then they played the Netherlands and won that game, which obviously they won the World Cup. You know, so it's going to be a rivalry. It's it's going to be a big rivalry for sure. <laughs> Clinton, I'm loving that. I never thought we might see the day when England and, and, and USA were rivals, rivals, like real. Real rivals, I know. Yeah, that's a, that's the improvement England are making under Serena. So, yeah, they, if they can do well and win this, yeah, um, most countries will start fearing England, that's for sure. I love that. Lacey, any other yeah. teams Any other teams in the, in the, in the Euros that you, um, you've been enjoying watching or you think England needs to keep an eye out for? Uh, I mean... I, at one point, I, you know, when they played Norway, I was kind of thinking, I don't know, but then they just literally just dominated them, you know. So with Ada Hegerberg, it's how I think it's how you yep. say her name, yep. but she's one of the good players on that team, and I was like, England need to watch this team, and then boom, they just win against them eight nil. <laughs> 
Lacey, thank you so much for giving us a call. It's so lovely to speak to you again and you know, listening to, to the game thank on you. Five Live and then giving us a ring and just appreciating that women, women's football over here as well. We, um, we love it, Clint, no, don't we? Of course we? we love it. We just had a call from America. It's brilliant. It's made my night. <laughs> <laughs> You're international at Yeah, that. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're going to speak to Phil now, who's in Cambridgeshire. Evening, Phil. Volume. Cal Camp selected. 